Hey guys, today's video I want to share with you guys some amazing finds that I found at both Dollar Tree and Dollar General. Plus I want to share with you guys some hit or misses of the things that I bought recently at Dollar Tree. Welcome back to Rhea's World of Ideas. If you are new to my channel, I am Rhea, and on my channel I love sharing all the ideas that I find helpful in my life and home, and hopefully you'll find them helpful in your life and home as well. So if you're not a subscriber already, don't forget to hit that subscribe button before you leave this video, and also don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you're always notified on all the new videos that I put out. And if you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up to let me know that you enjoyed it so that I'm able to bring more videos to you guys in the future that you guys will like. So with all that being said, let's jump into today's video. And like I told you guys in the intro, I have some things to share with you guys from Dollar Tree and Dollar General. And I decided to put these two things together because this isn't a big haul. Um, I'm trying to calm down on the things that I'm buying for my house. I'm trying to declutter. But it's some amazing things that I couldn't wait to share with you guys. But before that, I want to share with you guys three products that I'm actually going to return to Dollar Tree that I've tried and I didn't like. And so I always want to give you guys an update of the things that I purchased, uh, the things that are like a hit or miss. And then also I'm going to share with you guys some stuff that I did love that I share with you guys on Instagram already, but I kind of want to share with you guys, it, uh, share with you guys it in this video today. So the first thing I'm going to say that I did not like that was a, you know, just um, a straight miss for me was these charcoal facial wipes that I purchased at Dollar Tree that I share with you guys. I do like the facial wipes that they have at Dollar Tree. I share with you guys different facial wipes all the time. This one I had high hopes for because everybody talks about how great charcoal is for your skin. This one was just so drying, guys. It was so drying and it made my face, it just um, scratched up my face to where my face felt so raw and rough after it. I even added some water on it to kind of make it work because I bought two packs of these. So I'm trying to make the second one work because, you know, I already opened it. Um, but it just, it... It could not get soft at all. Like the other Dollar Tree facial wipes that I share with you guys, they are very soft. The Bolero ones, they're soft and I and I love them on my skin. I have sensitive skin and they do wonders on my skin. But this one was too rough for me and I really didn't like the smell, you guys. So this second pack, I'm actually going to return it back to Dollar Tree because it was a definitely, you know, miss for me. Another thing that I'm going to return to Dollar Tree is this Hard Candies Long Wear Sheer Envy Setting Spray. And it's not that it's bad. It's just that I have oily skin and I got the, they only had one of the mattifying one. They had a, it was like a blue top and it's, you know, to, it's like a mattifying spray. And this one, of course, it's 12, 12 hour hydration, which when, during the cold months, um, my skin tends to get really dry because I have psoriasis. I mean, I, I don't know if you could tell in some of my videos, my face is like red whenever I like, I don't have makeup on. I have a bad case of psoriasis, especially in the winter time. So I figured that this could hydrate my face, but it was a little bit too high, too much hydrating. If you guys seen in my, some of my clean with me videos recently, you could tell like in my intros, my face was really like shiny and greasy. And it's because I was trying this one and it was just too um, hydrating for me. It might work for you, but for me, it was a little bit too hydrating. I thought, I, like I said, I thought I could, you know, use it because of how dry my skin gets in the winter time, but it was still too dewy for me. And then the last thing I'm returning is this hard candy, even coat lift lash um 36 volume and it's because i actually did not know that this was going to be a colored um one and i think it says deep dive and i didn't really think it was going to be like a color um changing one i've bought different color ones before but i didn't think that this one was going to be like a color changing one and it actually is it gives you like this the same color that it is right there let me get that right there that's the color that you're actually going to get on your lashes which is, I mean, it's pretty cool if you want that. But for me, it didn't specify when I, when I looked at it that it was going to be a color changing one. I thought that was just going to be the color of the brush. But maybe it's my fault. You know, I didn't uh, read it thoroughly. But I am returning the second one that I bought of this one because it was a color one and I wasn't actually wanting color. Now, a plus, like a hit that was for me that I got at Dollar Tree was this, um, these Neutrogena facial masks. And if you guys have been following me on my Instagram, I did share with you guys on my Instagram using this one one week and then using this one the second week. And I told you guys on Instagram, I loved it. So this will be a repur uh, repeat purchase for me if I see it in Dollar Tree again, or even if I see it in the store, I'm going to pick these up because I love the way that it felt on my face and how it left my face. Um, it was just... Uh, it was a cooling effect. I really liked it. Left, this one really left my face soft. And But I did warn you guys on this one that this one is a peel-off mask. And to make sure you don't put it in your eyebrows. Because it does specify don't put it in your eyebrows. And I thought it was just like a regular sheet mask like this or something like that. Where you like wipe it off. I didn't really fully read it. 
that you had to peel it off and i almost took my eyebrow off guys so if you get this one um and they and it says it specifies do not put in your hairline do not uh avoid the eyebrows definitely follow the the, the instructions because you can lose an eyebrow so now let's jump into the Dollar Tree haul and it's not that many things but the things that I want to share with you guys are some amazing finds and the first thing I'm going to share with you guys is these beautiful and cute pastel plastic plates that they have at Dollar Tree right now. They come in four different colors. They have the lavender one, which that's the only color that I didn't pick up, but I did pick up this minty green one, this peachy pink peachy pink one and this teal blue one now looking at this well i don't know like the camera's actually picking up the colors correctly i think um but when you're in the store and you look at these two you might think that they are the exact same ones because sometimes when they're laying like this they actually look so similar but when i first saw them they were actually stacked up like this um in the it was like on an end cap and you could tell that this one has a little bit more of a bluish tint and this has a little bit more of a greenish tint but if you at first glance just look at these plates you would think that they are the same one but they're not one is a teal blue and one is like a minty green and i want to specify that to you guys because in case like you go for the minty green color or the blue color i want you to be able to pick up the right one that you want and so you might just like pick up these two um just real quick and think that these two are the same color but they're not and then get home and then be upset and try to go back in the stores and then it won't be there so that's why i always want to let you guys know if there's a difference between uh, a product sometimes they have like with the eggs like i shared with you guys that the glitter uh, patterns were different i want to specify it to you guys so these two look similar in the store but you really they're not they're two different colors one is a teal blue and one is a minty green so just a for fair warning for you guys but these are so adorable i love them they are so gorgeous the lavender one is a gorgeous color too but like i said i don't decorate with that color um, in my home so that's why i didn't pick it up and i picked up two packs of each of these and they come six in a pack now what i love about these is not only can you use these for easter to you know for easter entertaining but guys look how gorgeous these look they look like actual ceramic glass plates that you would find at home decor stores so you can put a tablescape down you can decorate your home you know your dining room table for easter you can use these to serve them but if you decorate your home for easter on the dining room table these will look like elegant real like ceramic plates like they are so gorgeous this one is the blue color the teal blue color right here and then this one is the peachy pink color so you guys can see like the difference. I hope that the camera's picking up the colors that they come in so you can actually tell the difference between the minty green and the the blue. Um, and so I love them. This is a great find. If you guys see this, pick them up because not only can you use them to entertain with an Easter time or to decorate your tablescape, but these will make great, amazing DIYs. You can make so many tear trays. You can make um, home decor things to go on your wall, home decor pieces with these plates. People all the time in the Dollar Tree community, um, DIY, the DIY Dollar Tree community have made so many beautiful things with just plates. So these gorgeous plates on their own, they look beautiful on their own, but if you can turn it into a DIY, it could be an amazing decor piece that looks like something expensive the home decor store but it's really just some dollar tree plates and so i love these and they they do feel like a sturdy plastic i will say and i mean i am holding like six and one but they do feel like a sturdy plastic so i just think that this is an amazing find at dollar tree right now so if you definitely um if you see it definitely pick it up because if you're a diy or if you just want to decorate your home these are amazing to do either or with now another thing that i picked up that was like an easter decor piece but or Easter decor, but I picked it up to decorate for springtime, is this little, um, it's called a craft bottle, but I see it as a cute little jar. So if, I don't know if you've been following my channel for a while, but if you have, I like to decorate with lemons come May time, because for me, lemons is like springtime, what, um, spring decor. So after my Easter stuff goes down, I'll put my lemons, um, my lemon decor up and also my navy blue. And so when I saw this jar, this is how it looks outside of the plastic. When I saw this jar with this lid, I thought this would be perfect to decorate my kitchen with or to do some type of DIY with during that time because this will definitely go with my lemon decor, my lemon and blue decor. And so I just had to pick up. I picked up two of these and I think they will be so cute to just, you know, for your tear trays or any type of kitchen decor that you wanna do. Plus, they also had another one of these. Um, that was the same pattern, but it came in this, which one and they came in like this minty color and so if you like this little minty green color they also have the same pattern 
in this color um, jar there as well. And they also have a plain white top jar. So you could do so many things with this. A lot of people have done a bunch of DIYs with these jars and I just feel like on its own, you can just fill it up with things for the kitchen and it could be a decor piece, but this is gonna be so cute. So stay tuned for that time when I bring out all of my lemon decor and all of my lemon decorating and stuff like that. Stay tuned to see what I'm gonna do with that. So another amazing find that I found at Dollar Tree that was new to Dollar Tree, I haven't heard anybody talk about it yet, is these LED string lights, but they are like a floral type of garden LED string lights. They have these little leaves on them. I thought this was amazing. I thought that this would be a great background for when I do my DIYs and I take the, the photos for you guys. I thought this would be a great little background, but you guys can also use this in your porch, you know, for the summertime, if you're decorating your porch or anything like that, or you can actually put this inside your home. This is gonna go fast and this is an amazing buy. Um, I have it actually opened up for you guys right here because I kind of wanted you to see how much you get. It's not a lot, it's not, oh, sorry. It's not a lot, so just bear that in mind if you're gonna make something and you want to wrap it around something, it's not a lot. But the lights, this is how they look lit. So let me see if I can get it so you guys can see it a little bit better. So this is how they look lit. I really do like it. It's a good background. You can turn it into like a circle, make a wreath out of it. Um, because the floral, the part that it's made with is kind of bendable. So if you wanted to make it into a wreath, you could. Um, you could do so many things with this. I just think that this is an amazing buy. Um, everybody always loves the LED lights at Dollar Tree and they always step their game up and always come up with new different LED lights. And this one I feel like is gonna fly off the shelves and it's gonna be so great for springtime and for summertime. I just love this one. And it takes two AA batteries um, and you will be seeing them all, you'll be seeing that type of string light um, in the background of my DIY pictures. Um, but yeah, that's a, that's a great buy. And it definitely, if you want something like that and you see it, scoop it up because those LED lights always go fast. So now let's move on to the Dollar General items that I want to share with you guys. Guys, Dollar General has really been stepping up their game, not only with like holiday decor stuff, but home decor stuff. I have recently shared with you guys some things that I found at Hobby Lobby, especially that big jar that I told you that I was able to score for only $14 and that Joanna Gaines had a similar jar to that in Target for $35. And so I was telling you how you can find some amazing um, home decor pieces in, in, um, in Hobby Lobby, which you can, but Dollar General has a lot of beautiful, gorgeous home decor items that you definitely need to check out. And the things I'm gonna share with you guys are all under $10. So the first thing I'm gonna share with you guys is this huge jar that only costs five dollars guys look at this huge vase jar it reminds me a lot of the one that i share with you guys from hobby lobby that i got for 14 dollars um this comes in like a little greenish color which it might not be some, a lot of people's color tones like i know a lot of people love the one that um tint has a tint of that light blue which is that that's the one i got from hobby lobby it was something similar to this a little bit bigger and it had that light blue tint to it which is everybody's favorite but this green can also be um beautiful in your home as well because i always think it's great to add a little bit of greenery to your home whether you're doing glam whether you're doing farmhouse whether you're doing modern adding greenery to your house whether it's with you know with actual florals or a jar or a vase, I think it just goes with any decor. So this right here, I was so happy. Like I said, it was only $5, guys. $5 at Dollar General for this huge vase. Look at the detail on this. It is so beautiful. They had it in like, kind of like the, the, the beachy section, which I'm gonna share with you guys another thing that um, they had there that was kind of like the beach section. So I feel like that they think that this goes with like nautical decor, which it can because the detailing on it looks like something that you would put like some fishnets in it or you would put like some uh, seaweed in it to decorate with it. But I think you could do so many things with this. So stay tuned to see how I'm gonna use this in my home to decorate. But for $5, guys, this thing is huge. This is a great deal to get at Dollar General. Another thing that I found at Dollar General, like I said, they had like the different sea things was this little anchor right here. Look at this anchor decor. I've seen so many people try to make DIYs, Dollar Tree DIY anchor decor, you know, out of Dollar Tree products and they spend way more than I spent with this. This one only cost me $3, guys. I'm showing you that right there. $3 for this huge anchor that comes with rope. It's a beautiful decor. People spend more DIY in this and I found this for $3 already made at Dollar General. So this was a great find and it would be, I'm gonna use it to decorate in my home when I bring out all my nautical decor because you know I do that for summertime. Another find that I found that day was this one. This was also in the, um, 
in the section that it was like I guess it was like a beachy I think it was like a nautical decor section and they had this one as well this one I got for four dollars so that you guys can see this one was four dollars it's a little bit smaller but look at the detailing on this guys it is so beautiful it's like this grayish it's like it's, it's a clear bottle but then it has like this grayish paint to it that kind of fades like an ombre this is so beautiful i feel like this can be very modern decor and very nautical beach decor as well and for four dollars this thing is beautiful as well all these other jars i've been that i'm sharing with you guys i know in home decor home decor stores and target those would go for like 15 20 to 35 dollars and i've basically showed you one that was six dollars and four dollars now the next one I'm going to share with you guys is if you like farmhouse, you're definitely going to like this next item. I could not believe I found this for $6. Look at this mason looking vase jar. Look how big it is, how huge it is. It's coming in that light blue that everybody likes. And I got this for $6 at Dollar General, guys. I couldn't believe it. You know that if you saw this at Target in the Joanna Gaines um, type of line or there's another lady that has a line there there too. They would have priced this for about 20 bucks. And no lie, 20 bucks. They would price the same exact size for $20. And I found this at Dollar General for six. They also had the same design in a kind of a navy blue color too. So if you guys want, if you guys like that color, you can go get it. So instead of this light blue, it was navy. But you guys know I love this light blue. And this is this type of design, this jar is a staple in like farmhouse. Everybody loves it look how beautiful it is and it has a little you know the rope twine on tw rope twine on it you can keep it on there if you want if you don't want it you don't have to keep it on there it just says bella mason from the mason jars i feel like with this jar you can use it to you can put like the um you know how dollar tree has those wooden uh what is the, those wooden kitchen kitchen spoons you could put that in there to fill it or you could just fill this up with flowers there's so many things you can do with this but for six dollars guys this is an amazing deal like i'm telling you all these that i'm sharing with you guys this one is five this one is six this one is four which this one i think would go for like 15 bucks at target i'm telling you it's it's a major score in Dollar General to get these beautiful home decor pieces that you know you would spend more in at Target and home decor stores. I, that, I couldn't wait to share that with you guys and I couldn't, I was so excited that I found those because those are amazing deals. Now moving on, I'm going to share with you guys some dollar things that I found, some dollar products that I found at Dollar General. I found this driftwood for a dollar at Dollar General and these are amazing to have for when you're gonna decorate um, for nautical and that beach decor theme. This one is kind of like a beige tan color. And then this one is kind of like that, you know, like that beachy blue, kind of like that light blue that you see in a lot of um, nautical decor. And like I said, you get a bag of those for $1. So I thought that was also a great deal as well. And then the last thing that I got from Dollar General was these straws. There were $1.25, these paper straws, because again, like I told you guys, I like decorating. Um, after Easter, I decorate in my lemon and blue decor, and so I thought these would be so cute for my coffee bar, um, to have in my coffee bar for when I redecorate it for you know, the lemon and blue season. So that is it for my dollar store haul, the things that I found at Dollar General and Dollar Tree. Guys, you definitely really need to check out Dollar Tree, I mean Dollar General. If you haven't gone into Dollar General before, you need to go check them out because they are owned by the same company, but they bring so many affordable things, especially when it comes to home decor. I found a lot of things that I didn't need, but I really wanted to get that I'm telling you guys, I know I keep repeating this, but I'm telling you guys, the things that they have there, you would see these things in other stores for way more and they are like this is sturdy i'm not saying this is not cheap either they didn't go cheap on this at all this is a sturdy like i'm looking at it the paint is gorgeous they even have it painted in the inside which sometimes when you get like this you know cheaper home decor stuff sometimes they skimp on the painting because we there's a lot of things i see in dollar tree that i won't buy because the painting is horrible um but for six dollars look at that it's even if the inside of it is still even like a that painted blue which is beautiful and the same thing with this this is such a tough material this is not it's not plastic this does not feel like it's gonna break on me easily this is actually good material that i got for five dollars guys i was so amazed so definitely check out your dollar generals if you want to redecorate your home or you just like to decorate or change up the things for the season definitely check out dollar general before you hit any target home decor, or even Hobby Lobby. And you guys know I love Hobby Lobby because you can find a good deal at Hobby Lobby. But even before you hit those stores, 
check out Dollar General because they have amazing things when it comes to home decor or just craft items or def and holiday items too. Their holiday items are amazing as well. So definitely check out Dollar General. So that is it for this video, you guys. Stay tuned for my next video, which should be coming out on Saturday, where I'm gonna share with you guys the rest of my Easter decor that I've done in my home. I really love how my home came out for Easter. I don't normally decorate for Easter, but Dollar Tree and Hobby Lobby and different places has so many beautiful home decor pieces for Easter that I could not resist decorating my home for Easter. And I am super excited to share with you guys how everything came out of my home. So definitely stay tuned for that video that's coming out on Saturday and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Hey guys, don't forget to click on the picture in the middle of the screen so you can subscribe to my channel and get notifications on all the new videos that I put out and check out these other two videos that I have posted on my channel on either side of my picture. Have a great day.